Hello everyone, John Robinson here, Power Technical Consultant for Eastern Nebraska and Western Iowa. Today I'd like to talk to you about Hem Copycat for the PowerFlex 750 series. Alright, and here we have an A6 hem on a PowerFlex 753. Now we're going to begin the copycat by pressing the menu key and scrolling over to the memory tab. Once there, we're going to pick hem copycat by pressing the 5 key. And of the two selections present, we're going to pick upload all ports as opposed to copycat from device to hem. Press the 5 key to initiate that. We're going to press enter to create a new file as none exists on this hem. And we're going to begin uploading from port 0. Port 1, Port 4, Port 6, and finally Port 14. This particular 753 has option cards installed in Port 4 and Port 6. Port 4 happens to contain an I.O. card and Port 6 contains an Ethernet card. Port 1 is the port for the HEM itself and Port 14 is the port for device logics, which I have programmed into this drive. By selecting upload from all ports, we can see that the HEM copycat function is grabbing parameters and programming from all the ports associated with the drive. Had we chosen copycat from device to him, we would have only uploaded from port zero, ignoring the parameters and settings in the other ports. This is an important distinction to remember if you want to copy the configuration from one drive to another. That second drive is going to have to have identical option cards in the same ports as the original for the copycat function to work properly. And also something important to note for an outed situation if you intend to keep a HIM on hand as a backup, that HIM will have to have all ports uploaded if you're going to properly reassert control on a new drive that has been installed after a previous drive has failed. Now, the programming in port 14 takes the most time to upload, so we're going to wait for this to finish. And there, it's asking us to confirm the upload. We're going to press Enter key to do so. And we have successfully saved a new file to our HEM. We'll press Escape key to go back to the original screen of the drive. And there we are. To recap, copycat from device to HEM only copies parameters from port 0, the main board. Upload all ports will copy parameters from all associated ports and peripherals. When downloading to another drive, said drive must have the same peripherals in the same ports. And note, Choose download all ports when downloading to a new drive. Thanks everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video and found it useful, do please like and subscribe. Have a good one.